We are learning tonight about the man who was killed while driving a street sweeper. 25 year old Kyle Stewart died when his truck rolled last night along Highway 5 in West Des Moines. KCCI's Andrew Mullenbeck is live along Highway 5 tonight. And Andrew, you talked with a co worker who saw this happen. That's right, Steve, and just below is Highway 5. We're to the east of the interchange where that accident happened, and today the emotions are still very raw. Cody Boone holds his daughter close, thinking about his co-worker and friend and the two young children he leaves behind. The two work together on a night crew, and Monday evening they were both driving to West Des Moines with Kyle Stewart driving a sweeper truck. I've driven that machine plenty of times myself. Um, so just to see it was, you know, I'm still in shock from the whole, whole ordeal. The cause of the accident is not known right now. What we do know is that the two were going from Carlisle to West Des Moines on Highway 5, and they were just getting on the ramp to the interstate at the time of the accident. Being a new father, as soon as I had her, you know, it, it opened up my eyes and uh, be very careful, you know. Um, this is something that I dread. He remembers Stewart as being gracious with his time and always willing to help. He had helped me on plenty of instances, and I know he's helped a lot of people do other things. I was moving this year. Um, he helped me move several of my vehicles to my new property. Just a day after the accident, it's impossible to have processed all the emotions, but Boone wanted to make sure people knew who his co-worker and friend was. He was just a real important person to a lot of people, and he's a really good person. So that's just what I wanted to get through. He just asked people to please drive carefully, especially when they're merging onto the interstate. We're live along Highway 5. Andrew Mullenbeck, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.